for ozone protection, solar cell. Due to highest strength to weight ratio, help in creating lightweight spacecraft. In health field, nano robot will be used for accurate and exact treatment of cancer or any other disease in future. Helps in developing sensor that can detect chemical weapon. In chemical industry, nanotech is used to prepare titanium dioxide, which is used to prepare sunscreen cream, purifying water, giving a shell of something. In electronic industry, forthcoming future nanotech will be widely used in electronic industries. Nanotechs are going to create a revolution in computer technology. Nanotech can help expand quantum computer and photonics. In creating fuels, it is used to create fuel cells of hydrogen ion. In manufacturing computer hardware, video games, console, memory chips, nanoprocessor can be built with this technology. In refrigerator, food items can be kept fresh using nanotech. 10% of nanoparticles are mixed with the main ingredient of refrigerator. Now, I talk about advantage and disadvantage of nanomaterials. So first talk about advantage of nanomaterials. First advantage is things that are made of nanomaterials. Nanotubes are durable, small, light and smart. Some other advantages are medicine created with nanotech smart drug treat patient more efficiently and nanotransistor, nanodiode, plasma display are creating revolutionary changes in electronics. Now, Look at the disadvantage. So, first disadvantage is nanotechnology is expensive. Other one is if nanotechnology expands fully, then atomic energy is readily available. That can be dangerous for women. New polarization of economics may appear due to the fall of cost of traditional fuel, diamond, gold, natural gas, PDC. As a conclusion to this topic, I would like to say that. Nanotechnology is a brand new technology that has just begun. It is a revolutionary science that will change all what we knew before. The future that we were watching just in science fiction movies will in the near, near future be real. This new technology will first of all keep us healthy because of nano robot that will repair every damage that we have in our body. Secondly, it will give scientists the ability to manipulate the combination of atom in an object and to turn it into a lighter, stronger and more durable object than before. Just by using carbon nanotubes, they are known to be a hundred times stronger than steel and in addition to that, they are very flexible. Thirdly, nanotechnology will give us, a, give us an abundant energy because it will transform energy more effectively. Now, coming to the very important session of this discussion, which is question answer session. Is anyone having any question regarding this topic? Yes. How can nanomaterial combat pollution? Okay. Nanomaterials could help us mitigate pollution. They are sufficient catalyst and mostly recyclable. To help slow the climate changing rise in atmosphere carbon dioxide levels, Researchers have developed nano carbon dioxide harvester that can suck atmospheric carbon dioxide and deploy it for industrial purpose. Nanomaterial offer promising approach to this because they have a large surface area to volume ratio for interacting with carbon dioxide and properties that allow them to facilitate the conversion of carbon dioxide into other things. At present, scientists across the globe are developing nanomaterials. Data efficiently can use carbon dioxide from air, capture toxic pollutant from water, and degrade solid waste into useful product. A nano carbon dioxide harvester that, that uses water and sunlight to convert atmospheric carbon dioxide into methanol, which can be employed as an engine fuel, a solvent, an antifreeze agent, and a diluent of ethanol. Is there any other question? Yes. How nanotechnology is being used for in the mobile industry to enhance its performance. Okay. Nanomaterials in the automotive sector offer advantages such as lightweight, reduction in friction and emission by the engine, reduced wear and corrosion resistance, UV resistance and advanced electronics and sensor. 
The coating with nano material is an effective practice to enhance the protection and scratch resistance of automotive body. Moreover, it also improves the appearance and durability over a longer period. The main advantage of applying nanotechnology in automobile include providing lighter and stronger body parts, improving fuel consumption efficiency and therefore achieving a better performance over a longer period. Is there any other question? No. Okay. Then I conclude her. I hope you have you all have enjoyed this session. Thank you.